Hey, what's up? This is Chosen, joined by the boy here. Uh, first time in a long time. Uh, oh, you got your, uh, is that your Twitch hat? Okay, nice, okay. One of them. Okay, cool. cool. Well, yeah, uh, let, let me do the intro here real quick. I'm getting distracted already, but yeah, mm -hmm. first time we've got Darth on the channel in a while. We're gonna talk about a new competition. Uh, I mean, competition, fun type of thing that we're gonna be doing together and keep you in the loop on exactly what that is going to entail. So let's get into it. Let's get into it indeed. Alrighty, what is going on there, uh, DM? Fresh off of uh, finally getting to meet each other after uh, like three and a half years at TwitchCon. You got your Twitch gear on, I see, so very nice. Yep, unfortunately I had to meet you. And uh, after all the good times we had, it, we knew we had to come back and automatically fight against each other in the competition yep yep we 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 knew that the the rivalry was spawned i so we darth wanted to play against me in bags at the uh hotel pool and i <laughs> slaughtered him so bad that he was like we're doing a gaming yeah, competition okay. <laughs> you did you know you got you can't take you anywhere man you, you win at bags you win at golf you throw the baseball faster it's like you just you can't get anything done with you around you know well, this is this is your redemption arc. This is your this is your your back end good with Plarium. They let you come on my stream and you're you're ready to 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 have your redemption arc, your triumphant return. This to is my Tyler one arc <laughs> back to the to the community. This is your triumphant return. Yeah, so like did my variety stream. Yeah, so you've been you've been doing other stuff besides raid as your main kind of stuff for yeah. like gosh, what like a year now? Yeah, a little more than that, I think. I mean, I, I, I've been, I've not been doing raid for a while now. It's been, it's almost been multiple years, I think, at this point. Yeah, yeah, and uh, you know, for anybody that hasn't been or hasn't been following Darth, or they're just familiar with my channel, Darth's one of the OGs of Raid Shadow Legends, and uh, did it as his main game for like two, two and a half years, and since then has become uh, running a different channel where he's doing a lot of Diablo Immortal, and that was his main thing for a while, and he's uh, you know, after still hanging is. out with yeah, that's pretty much what I'm still focusing on at the moment, but yeah, yeah, um. I have this main channel just doing nothing where I'm not really, I mean, I'm uploading like random vlog content and some stuff from the vacation and whatnot, but I'm not really uploading on the main channel anymore. It's just sitting there. So it's like, well, probably should start putting some videos back on the main again. There you go, and and what better to, to kick off that project than to go against me. And what we're gonna be doing, what we're thinking of doing anyway as of right now, is we're both gonna start free to play uh, accounts, and the reason for this, we're not the we're not pioneering this. We're not the first ones to do a free to play account or anything. The reason for this is it gives Darth an opportunity to acclimate back into the community, have something uh, as a fun project for his main channel, and it gives me an opportunity to get a fresh perspective. I'm like almost four years in on my main account, and it'll be a great opportunity for me to kind of reset my perspective and understand what it's like for players that haven't been playing for four years like me. So it's kind of a win win for both of us. We're gonna try it out for a few weeks. Fun little competition where we're going to let viewers vote on who's doing better we're going to probably start at like three to five weeks see how it's going see if people are enjoying it and, and kind of go from there is, is that kind of the plan as of now yeah i think the idea is we do uh every week we come back together and see what kind of progress we made that week let the viewers decide who had the better week and just just try to have fun with it i mean really all i want out of this is just to have some fun make some fun content where i'm not stressing about stuff just have a good time. I mean, that that's all I really want to do. Mess around with, with the game again, see what it's like. I know it's changed significantly, and there's like half of the champions I weren't even there in the game last time I played. So it'll be kind of fun to mess around with it for, you know, a couple weeks or something again. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Do you, uh, are, are, how acclimated are you with some of the new stuff? Like, I think. Oh, I know nothing. I, I, I don't know any of the new stuff at all. I, the new characters, no idea. I know there's like basically red stars. Someone DM to tell me that I called it a year ago and that there was like red stars in the game now, basically. And so I know there's some memes and I know there's some new heroes, but I don't know anything. I don't, I don't really look at the game anymore. Yep. Yep. I know. I hear you. Well, at least you know about the awakening mechanic and you kind of left after like the forge and the doom tower and some of that stuff was coming to the game. So that would have been when Darth kind of, did, did you ever play with uh, tag team arena? Yeah, I was around during Tag Team Arena. Um, I left 
I started playing other games, and when Genshin, kind of when Genshin came out, was really the one of the first games to grab my attention and take me away from Raid for a while. I started covering Genshin for a little bit there. So ever, however long that's been, really. I mean, Genshin's been out for a while now. Enough that people are already complaining about it, having a dead end game. So it's been out a minute. Nice. Did you finish Faction Wars on your main account? I have Lydia. Yeah, I got Lydia. Oh, nice. Okay, that's really good then. So you did finish Faction Wars. Okay, cool. Yep, that's good. Then uh, I guess uh, when do you when do you want to start this? Should we start it like on Monday? So we're recording I this. Think I'm probably Monday is probably the best. Tomorrow uh, I'm gonna go visit a friend. Sunday we're celebrating my dad's birthday. Monday I get my Sprinter van that I gotta go test drive. The mechanic slash friend that took a deal to fix it for me fixes it Monday. So Monday night I would say Tuesday, Monday, Tuesday, one of those days. Okay, will not be free to start. Cool. Yeah, I'm down for whatever, whenever you want. Uh, and we could do it like start on Monday and then we could do like our weekly collab to compare our weeks like on Sunday or something like Sunday night. Yeah, we can, and, and yeah. We'll, we'll, I'm sure we'll figure something out. It'd be fun kind of to um, both like simultaneously stream it for like an hour a day or something too would be kind of fun. You know what I yeah. mean? Like we from each side of the view or something. I, there, we, we, yeah. could do, we could do something. There, the, we're, this is just the video out there to throw out what we're going to be starting and get some ideas i'm sure some comments will have some good ideas on what to do yeah yeah that. definitely like, like reach out to us on uh on discord or down in the comment section and and let us know if you, uh, something that would be fun for you to see as a viewer uh because ultimately we're trying to provide fun content as a competition to react to exactly. uh, darth and help him learn the game from that new perspective and help me uh like i said in the, earlier in the video to to get you know raid from a new perspective as well so let us know any ideas that you have down below and uh yeah, it'll be a lot of fun to to dive in and and crush Darth in this uh, free to play competition. Yeah, I'm not even really worried about relearning the game. Like, I, I don't, I don't really think that I need to learn too much. I just want to, I just kind of want to have some fun with it. You know, that Ray gave me a lot of really funny videos to make. There was a lot of good content in the editing and the memes and stuff, and I just, I kind of want to make some more funny videos. That's I get that out of it i'll be happy I yeah guess. people a lot of people probably don't remember the the golden days the golden age of raid uh you know <laughs> back in the back in the day when none of us knew what we were doing and we were just yeah. <laughs> trying random stuff because like uh we were talking about this off camera the other day or the other night how raid was probably the last time that that's ever going to happen because any game that's even remotely close to raid is gonna have a thousand content creators like before it's even released, like in beta. You're gonna have yeah, like- Yeah, there really wasn't that many YouTubers. I mean, yeah. we, I think I was like the fourth YouTuber on the scene or something. Cause I, I think we had like two and 4,000 subs. Or we didn't have very many subscribers and we were pretty new to YouTube at the point uh, when we started covering raids. So um, for me, yeah, I mean, for me, it's, it's YouTube has been, from the business side of it, it's been drastically evolved and I don't know about you, but I feel like I've become a YouTuber. Before I was kind of just like a gamer, like randomly recording videos. And and then it's as time gets better, it's like you kind of just focus on how to get better and better at the YouTube side of things. And then you try different games and all that. And so it's kind of fun, funny to look back and, and see some of the really bad videos I did back in the day with like bad audio quality, like horrible editing, like not like starting the video like two minutes before I even say my first word, like just weird stuff, you know, it's always kind oh, of funny to there. go back and look at the low quality. Oh yeah, my my first videos were me like looking down at an iPad while it's like mirroring to my <laughs> screen, and yeah, it's just uh, awful. Um, but yeah, that's the that's the evolution. I'm trying my best to hold on to my roots as a gamer before a YouTuber. I'm trying to you know stick in the uh, you know with the StarCraft and the Overwatch and and keep my gaming acumen high. But yeah, no, it, I I get what you're saying. You do have to focus on the content side of things uh, for sure if you want a channel to be successful. Well, well, it's to your point. It's just it's it maybe before you could get away with not focusing on the YouTube side of things, but it's so it's so competitive in the last few years. I feel like there's so many people make making content at the moment, and with COVID, I feel like a lot more people started working from home too and kind of perked their ears up to the whole oh that you can make money online or you can work for yourself or whatever. So a lot of content creators started that during that time as well. And before that, it didn't feel like there was maybe it's just because I was new to it, I didn't know as many people, but. It, like you're saying, it definitely felt like it was a lot easier back in the day to start up a YouTube channel, or at least 
when we were doing Raid, it felt a lot easier. Because, I mean, where there was like, there was us and Incredible John and, and like, uh, Kizzle was still making videos at the time. There wasn't really like that many. Kizzle was a little bit later. Um, it was like, it was like me and Incredible John and Salt, um, and like and Ollie Mango plays. Mango Seven, Ollie plays. Yeah, we're like the first ones. Then there was that next wave of like you and Stu, and then Kizzle was a little bit after, and it just kind of slowly got more and more. You know, Cold Brew and Hell Hades, and, and all, all these people kind of showed up as the game grew in popularity and kind of evolved throughout the years, but. Yeah, that's uh, that's what the plan is as of now, and and where our heads at, and and we're gonna have fun with it, stream it, uh, and uh, and see how it goes. Have a couple of laughs. It, as long as it's a, as long as I get a couple of fun videos out of it, it'll be it'll be worth the time. There you go. Well then, uh, thanks, Darth, for for coming over to the channel and hanging out, and I will look forward to our fun little uh, competition versus each other. I'll link to Darth's channel down below if you uh, are newer to Raid and aren't familiar with Darth. I'll, I'll, I'll put that down so you can find the stuff that he does over there. And yeah, that will do it for us. Is there anything you wanted to say on the uh, on the way out, Darth? No, it's not really a plug situation. It's a pretty, uh, this is a pretty chill challenge just to have some fun with it. So if you just want to watch something kind of casual and fun for the next week or two, that's what we're going to be messing around with. Come see, come watch it if you want. Cool. All right. Thanks, Darth. Have a good one and take it easy, everybody. Thanks for watching. Peace.